హలో ఎవ్రీ వన్ వెల్కమ్ టు ఈశ్వరి తనిక్ష ఛానల్ స్టూడెంట్స్ ఇన్ దిస్ వీడియో వీఆర్ గోయింగ్ టు లర్న్ ట్రిక్స్ టు రైట్ ద ప్రోడక్ట్స్ ఆఫ్ హెల్ హోల్ హార్ట్ జెలెన్స్కి రియాక్షన్ సో స్టూడెంట్స్ ఇన్ దిస్ వీడియో వీఆర్ గోయింగ్ టు స్టడీ ఫస్ట్ ద రియాక్షన్ అండ్ మెకానిజం ఫార్ దిస్ అండ్ ఆల్సో వీఆర్ గోయింగ్ టు టేక్ సమ్ ఎగ్జాంపుల్స్ అండ్ వీ విల్ ట్రై టు రైట్ ద ప్రోడక్ట్ ఫార్ దోస్ రియాక్టన్స్ యూజింగ్ ది ట్రిక్ so first let us study the reaction of hell whole heart zelensky reaction so students here we are going to take acid so this is the acid containing alpha hydrogen atom so i hope you know what is alpha hydrogen atom so this is carboxylic carbon to this carbon next carbon is called as alpha carbon this is alpha carbon and hydrogen atom which is present with alpha carbon is called as alpha hydrogen atom so how many alpha hydrogen atoms are there here there are two alpha hydrogen atoms so we have to take acid containing alpha hydrogen atom then we are going to treat with halogen so halogen can be chlorine or you can take bromine in the presence of red phosphorus and then you are going to hydrolyze the product the product what you are going to get is alpha halo carboxylic acid that is one alpha hydrogen will be replaced by halogen see here how many alpha hydrogens are there two are present here there is only one alpha hydrogen atom another is replaced by a halogen suppose if you have taken chlorine here cl will be present if you have taken bromine then here br will be attached to alpha carbon so therefore it is called as alpha halo carboxylic acid this is the reaction now let us study the mechanism for this mechanism for this reaction so in the first step what happens is in the first step you can see red phosphorus we have taken here red phosphorus and then in the presence of halogen we are taking two things here phosphorus and then halogen so phosphorus will react with halogen and it will form px3 so this is the first step and in the second step what happens is take this acid r ch2 c double bond o oh and then the product which is formed in the first step px3 so now what will happen is this oh will be replaced by one of the halogen from here so it will become r ch2 c double bond o and then x so from here halogen will be replaced here so oh will be replaced by halogen so this is the second step so now in the third step what happens is so r ch one hydrogen i'll write like this c double bond o x so now so what is one more uh, reactant here halogen so x and xl right here so now what will happen is this bond will shift here and this double bond is going to move here so now as a result what you will get is you will be getting r ch double bond so this bond is shifting here it becomes double bond double bond c and then o this hydrogen this hydrogen will shift here it will become oh and then x so here this is the slow step so let us take halogen in the next step so this is the slowest step so here you can see en group is there and all is there so this is enol compound so hydrogen will be uh, shifted to oxygen so this is the slowest step and keto enol this is the enol product form next in the fourth step
R C H double bond C O H X. So take this one. Now we are taking one more reactant that is halogen. So now what happens is this double bond will attack halogen and this will shift here. So you will be getting R C H. This halogen will get attached to this carbon. So halogen carbon. So this carbon atom will get a positive sign and then O H then X. So now what will happen is carbon is having a positive sign. So this bond is going to shift here. So as a result what you will get R C H X C double bond O X you will get. So next step what happens is hydrolysis will take place. So this is hydrolyzed. So when it is hydrolyzed see this bond will break. So OH will be added here and H will be added here. So what you will get R then CH X C double bond O OH OH C, C double bond O OH so you are getting acid where at the alpha position halogen is substituted so this is called as alpha halo carboxylic acid so this is the mechanism for this reaction so now when a reactant is given let us uh, use a trick to write the product for this reactants So see here this is the first compound given. So you are treating with bromine in the presence of red phosphorus. What is the product formed? So students first identify alpha hydrogen atom. So whether alpha hydrogen atom is present here. So this is the alpha carbon and three alpha hydrogen atoms are there. So one hydro alpha hydrogen atom replaced by bromine. So you will be getting CH2BrCOOH. So this is the product. Next this one. So we will take this acid. Again we are treating with bromine in the presence of red phosphorus. So check whether it has alpha hydrogen atom. So this is the alpha carbon and it has two alpha hydrogen atoms. So one you replace with bromine. CH3C. So one you are removing one will be present with it. One hydrogen, one bromine and then COOH. So students this carbon is a chiral carbon. So whenever chiral carbon is present. Chiral carbon meaning is it has four different groups. If it is having four different groups then it will exist in plus form and minus form. So always check if a chiral carbon is present it exists in two different forms plus and minus form. Next we will check for this. So this is ben uh, benzoic acid. So whether alpha hydrogen atom is present here. So see here this carbon doesn't contain any hydrogen atom. So no alpha hydrogen atom. So no reaction takes place. No reaction. Why? Because there is no alpha hydrogen atom present. That is the reason. Next. So here this is the alpha carbon and two hydrogen atoms are there. So one you replace with bromine. Carbon. One you replace with bromine. Another hydrogen atom is there. And then one acid. So again this carbon is chiral carbon. So if it is chiral carbon. Why it is chiral carbon? Four different groups are present. So it will exist in two form. That is plus form and minus form. Next last question. So this question I want you to try. So uh, tell me whether the reaction takes place or not. If it does not take place, tell me the reason why the reaction does not take place. So write your answer in the comment section. So students, uh, you can subscribe the channel and also share this video with your friends. I will meet you in the next video students. Bye. Take care.